Well, here we go. We are going to try to clinch the division title. Um, magic number is one, so all we need is a victory today, and the Braves can't do anything about it. The Braves have been really rude and on a win streak, um, which is like just basically delaying the inevitable. Um, it's not hurting them in the wild card either. Um, they have they have a five game lead with four to play, so they've clinched the number one seed. So no matter what, they will play whoever the two seed of the wild card is, um, which is either right now the Giants or the Padres. If the Padres win in their game today, they will go in advance. So they would basically make it, and that would eliminate the Brewers and the Mets from contention. Um, AL East, Central, and West still in the same boat. Um, but the playoff race in the American League wild card is on fire. The White Sox will clinch today. Um, no matter what, they will they will make it. They'll, they're going to be a wild card team. Um, but it's going to be between the Orioles, Twins, Rays, or the Angels in order to make it all the way. Um, now the Rays and the Angels, they already they already played and lost, so that's basically putting them at a disadvantage. It's basically going to be up to the Orioles and Twins today, and we'll basically see what kind of shape that they're in. But no matter what, nobody is eliminated today, um, except for possibly the Mariners. So because the most the Mariners can do is get 80 wins and any of these four teams win one game and they're eliminated. So let's just get into today's game. We have Nola on the hill for us today. We are going to be wearing our blues because today is Thursday. And uh, yeah, so let's get into it. We got Nola on the hill. I am not allowing any changes, so let's go. Let's win it. Okay, all set to go. Off now it's going to be Key Brian Hayes. Key Brian Hayes. And here it comes. That's inside, and we're underway. Next one misses. And the count is 2-0. Oh. Right through there for a strike. Liner to second. It picked on the hop. Gathers and throws. One out in the top of the first. Connor Joe, the next pirate to hit. In there for strike one. Inside oh. just missed. One and one. And yeah. that gets the inside corner for a strike. Stays alive. That one misses in the dirt. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Brian Reynolds here. And first offering is fouled off. Right-hander kicks deals. That one to first. He steps on the bag. Third out. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. For the Phillies, the designated hitter, Kyle Schwarber. The pitch. To the right side, Choi takes it himself. One gone, bottom half of the first. Trey Turner in the box now as he leaves that one up high. 
Swing and a miss. And now it's even one and one. Man, he really sells the changeup with that arm action. In there. And so now one, one and two. two. Well, he got away with the mistake right there. A curveball that backed up a little bit, stayed high in the zone. You won't want to throw that one again. Pulls the string with the changeup, struck him out. Two outs, base is empty. And now here is Harper. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. This guy's not wasting any pitches. Hitters got to get into swing mode. This is a good time to expand the zone, oh, throw something maybe down in the dirt. Can't connect on the curveball, struck him out. Second inning set to go. Here's the shortstop at the play. O'Neill Cruz. Nola back to work. Check swing, no appeal. One and oh. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. The throw is still in time, and they come away with an out after a tricky start to the play. Jack Sawinski, batting with one down, takes a strike. That one pushed foul. Second inning here, no score. That's foul off to the right side, keeps the A.B. going. up the middle in a base hit. Good job of just putting the ball in play with two strikes. Just an awesome swing of the bat, quick hands, and just launched the baseball. 108 on the exit velocity. Man, that is coming off the bat pretty good. I know he's feeling good about it. Into third now. So runners at the corners and one out. Rodolfo Castro, the next pirate to hit. That yeah. one's in there, 0 and 1. Got the dish, oh, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, boo. Rudders are at the corners, one away. Next pitch oh. is outside. Good eye in that oh. spot. It's a good take. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Next is the Pirates DH. Matt Frazier. Off the mark there. Ball one. One ball, no strike. Sawinski on third. Choi on at first with two down. Next pitch is outside. Ball two. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss. And that is that. Here in Philadelphia, here's Nicholas Castellanos. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. Going to. Wouldn't chase that one time. Two. The one two. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. He's a little out front, but did a good job keeping the hands back long enough to foul that pitch off. The next offering oh. misses. It's two and two. You see how the catcher strike. wanted that pitch up and in. Wanted to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing, that high fastball. You have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. Next offering okay. misses, and now it's three and two. Hard 
ground ball base knock. He was all over that one. Didn't make quality hit. contact on the ground ball to the pull side, but sometimes it's just a matter of finding a hole in the defense. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. And that's in there for strike one. Slice the other way. That's a base hit. Castellanos headed for third. The throw in. And the throw's offline. Safe at third. A couple of singles back to back. I'll tell you. Man, it's such a good that feeling when you smoke a line no, drive into the gap like that. I mean, sure, home runs are king, but I feel like nothing makes you feel like a true professional hitter more than a bolt the other way. Runners on the corners, no outs. And that one is lifted in the air. Reynolds gets under it. Squeezes it. And there's one down. This is Bryson Stott. Two for six so far in the series. And the first pitch misses for ball one. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. First and third, one down. Line drive, could be extra bases. One runs in. Here comes Real Muto around third. Cut off, now a throw home. Not in time, he's safe at the play. It's 2-0. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. And now it's Alec Bohm. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. That one drifts That's inside. Runner at second here, one gone. Ripped to right, base in. Stop. Around third, Joe. Fires it to the plate. The run comes in to score from second, and they're up by three. Comes through with the RBI. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Boom. Leads off first with one away. Out into left center for a line drive base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. And they'll have runners at the corners after a one-out single. Stringing them together, that's three hits in a row. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. One's in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. Schwarber in the box with one away as he takes ball one. 0 for 1, he grounded out in his first at bat. Next one is oh, off the plate, and yeah, that's ball two. Well, usually a high level of confidence when you're facing a young pitcher out there on the mound. In this situation, ahead 2-0. He's put himself in a really good spot. Next pitch in for a strike, three and one. Thought the green light might be on right there, but maybe not. If you're looking to swing in that count, that's the pitch you want. Good plate ball appearance four. there. Able to take the walk. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right no, there. No, no. Pretty much gifted no, in sure first no, base no. with a quick free pass. One out, base is loaded. Trey Turner at the plate. Strike one. Oh and one. Comes up empty on the swing. 0 oh, 2 now. Man, he was really tardy on that fastball. Great job of setting him up by throwing the curveball. Add some velocity to it. On the now this one's well hit. Way back there. On its way and out of here. Grand slam. 
His 22nd homer of the year, and they add to their lead. It's 7-0. Well, he comes through big time with the grand slam here, but you also got to give some credit to the guys ahead of them. Good at bats to get on base and really set the table for a very special moment in this one. Pirates with a new arm on the mound, Rich Hill. He's got a wicked breaking ball in his arsenal, and it's definitely one of his go-to pitches when he needs an out. So one out, nobody on. And now for the Phillies, Bryce Harper. First offering, misses the mark. One and out. Still only one out here in the inning. Swings and misses at the breaking ball in the dirt. Going to really need to hang in there with that front side against this left-handed breaking ball. That misses oh. the zone, and that's ball two. This hitter's looking for a fastball, but I'm not sure he's going to get one. Pitcher doesn't have to challenge him. Two, two. If he feels better about his off-speed secondary stuff, then stay with it. Here's a 2-2. Two -two. And that is there. Harper frustrated as he's rung up on strikes and he lets the plate umpire know it and first offering is fouled off and now the lefty keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball ground ball left side Gets it to first, and Castellanos is out. Inning over. Back here at the ballpark, top half of the third inning. Here's the Pirates catcher now, Henry Davis. Yeah. Edge of the zone, call the strike. Going one. Well, every pitcher wants to run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some guys. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse. Go out. Not in time. He's safe. Well, that's one of those knocks where you almost expect to get some jabs from your teammates when you get back hey, to the hey. dugout. Not much you can do about that one on the mound. Made a good pitch inside and jammed him. He just found a way to fight it off the other way and make it work. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Davis at second with nobody out. Swing and a ball hit out towards left center field. Makes the grab, one down. Now, that's a tough play for the infielder, ranging back into the outfield. There's part of him that's saying, hey, where are you at, outfielder? Call me off. But he stayed focused and made a nice catch right there. Joe takes a ball as he stands in for the second time. That's in there. And the count one and one. The one one is fouled off. One out and a runner at second. Swings and misses. Had him out front for strike three. And now it's going to be Brian Reynolds. That's in there. That's strike one. No ball. One strike. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Here's the speedy catcher, JT Real Muto. Hill back to work. And first offering is fouled off. You know, these fills really impressing me with the quality of their bats in this one. It's been fun getting a chance to see them go to work. They jumped all over the starter and knocked him out of the game early. He just was never able to settle in, and the damage was done by the time he got the hook. Next pitch misses. Now one and two. I mean, when you're chasing the opposing starter in the first inning or two, that's just such a tone setter. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back on the infield. Got to the spot, turned around, and made wow. a nice catch. Goldie, the next to hit, takes outside. This to third. Sends it across to first. And a couple of quick outs. 
Two outs, base is empty. Bryson Stott now at the plate. And first offering is fouled off. Oh, and two as he waves at that Football. one. Two strikes. Lifted in the air, right center field. Reynolds on the run. Pulls it in after a long run. All set for the start of the inning. Here's O'Neill Cruz. There's the strike. He's been pitching well, but we'll see what kind of adjustment the hitters make this second time through the order. Yeah. We'll know if he's got really good stuff in this one or not. Bows that off to the left, and we'll do it again. Swung on, belted. Back there. Banks off the wall. So digging in, Jack Sawinski. Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. And now the hitter, G-Man Choi. Ground ball could be two. There's one. Return throw to first, and that's two. Man, that is such a tough double play to execute as a first baseman to not only field the ball and make a good throw to second with a runner in the baseline, but also to hustle back to first base and get set up to receive the return throw. That takes great footwork and an awareness of where yeah. the bag is. A lot of practice to oh, get that one right. Oh, and two now. And down on strikes he goes. Third out, and that ends the frame. Bottom four. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Alec Bohm. Well, on paper, it's favorable to have a fairly quick inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left side, same side he throws from. you one. Swing and a ball lined out towards center. Reynolds pulls it down, one up, one down. Brandon Marsh steps to the plate, singled and scored his first time. Pitch misses nope, inside, it. and it's 1-0. Oh. That to right. Joe has a beat on it. He's got it, and there's two away. Kyle Schwarber stands in for the Phillies. He's 0 for 1. Swing and a miss. Oh and one. Strike one. Lifted in the air down the left side. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is that. Back here, Citizens Bank Park. Ready now for the fifth inning. Now it's the DH, Matt Frazier. Cut. That one's in there. Strike one. You know, these Pirates finding ways to get on base, but they still need help driving them home. They've had and it stays fair. And it kicks off the base of the wall. Now he'll turn for second. And he's there with a leadoff double. Just a great approach. Looked like that was exactly what he wanted to do with that pitch. And right off the bat, he knew he was taking that wide turn at first to head for second. Harper makes the grab. Runner tagging for third. And he makes it up to third with one away. And you got to give some credit to the other side as well. They've been able to get out of a few tough jams, but frustration is mounting for this offense, no doubt. Hayes yeah. in the box again. Takes a strike. Up the middle. Can't glove it cleanly. So a man aboard. Now the number two hitter, Connor Joe. Right side. And that's just foul. Grounded to third. Could be two. Now he launches a throw over his head. And he'll make it up to second as he advances on the throwing error. Brian Reynolds, the next pirate to hit. Splits the plate. 0-1. Oh, 
Tried to check his swing there. Appeal to third. And yes, he offered at it. That one is hammered. Right field. That's back there. And that one is out of here. Brian Reynolds leaves the yard. His 22nd homer of the year in 7-5. Here's a speed threat. O'Neill Cruz. And there's the strike. Well, a really rough inning out there on the mound. And uh, this is one of those where you learn a lot about a guy's toughness and his ability to turn the page and keep pressing forward. Got him looking. Called strike three and a fastball up in the zone. Up next for the Pirates, Jack Sawinski. And first offering is fouled off. And the righty deals. Fought off foul. Oh, and two now. Gets a piece and stays alive. Two outs. Foul ball still 0 and 2. Next offering is foul back. Phillies fans want a strikeout. That misses off the outside edge. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. In an era with a lot of swing and miss and strikeouts, you got to love it at bat like this. No one giving in. Next pitch off the play. And the count's even at two. Back to the mound. And it gets by him. Having himself a really nice game at the plate. Tenth pitch of the at bat, and he was able to put it in play, find a hole, and get a knock. Choi in the box now. No balls in a strike. One for two. Now fly ball to right center. It gets down a base hit. And that'll put runners at the corners with two away. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. Got a change up and a pretty good one, too. Outside corner, but he just got extended and put the barrel on it. Showed he has a lot of plate coverage on that swing right there. Castro up to bat next. Lays off for a ball. Who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. That one catches the zone, and the count 1 and 1. Well, they've been able to score four runs off of him in this inning, and this is where you want to just max out, get as much as you can, give him one of those tough... Diving, and he can't make the play. Runner from third, in to score. And now they trail by 1. Matt Frazier, the next to hit, and time is called for a mound visit now. Big moment in this game, so they'll talk it over. Well, I guarantee you, after that last visit from the pitching coach, all they did was remind his pitcher, focus on this hitter and nothing else. Next offering is in for a strike. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Trey Turner now. Here comes a pitch. And that clips the inside corner. Well, these Phillies putting together some really good at-bats in this game. There's been a lot to like with how they're approaching their chances at the plate. It looked to me like they really wanted to get to the starter early, get him out of the game before he settles in. So I'd say mission accomplished. Up and in, and he gets out of the way. Cuts on it and misses. That's a strikeout. Had him out front for strike three. Here's Bryce Harper. Harper. And takes low for ball one. This is a very important inning here. After scoring all those runs, you want your pitcher to come out and just mow them down. The offense has worked hard. It's shut down inning time. One down, base is empty. And that's downstairs and outside.
foul back our way and that's out of play. Left hand hitter waits. And that one hammered Reynolds. Going back, back some more to the warning track, makes the catch. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Foul off down the right side. Lined, and that's a base hit. Multi-hit game for him now, and with the lack of results he's been having lately, I'm sure he's feeling some relief. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Castellanos off of first with two away. In the air, right field. Joe has a beat on it. And he makes the catch. And that'll do Here's the new pitcher for the Phillies, James Karinchek. He pitched yesterday, and we'll see him once again. And a pitch. Davis in the box now. Takes strike one. No ball. One strike. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Couldn't catch up to the heater. So the Pirates batting order turns over. And here is Key Brian Hayes. Now one and one. That's a little bit low. That one in for a strike, two and two. Well, he missed a hittable off-speed pitch right there. Not sure exactly what the timing. Sometimes you get a backup breaking ball. You're expecting it to make its move at the end. It never does. And you're tied up. Stop. Makes the play. And there's two away. Joe, the batter now, as he swings and misses for strike one. And that's down and away. Swings and misses. And the count, one and two. This one high in the air to left center. Castellanos gets under it. And puts the squeeze on that. And that's the inning. Well, we go bottom six. And here's Paul Goldschmidt. Goldie in his 13th season over 1,000 runs batted in in his career swing and this one's blasted it's got a chance bangs off the wall safe at second and stepping in is the speedy Bryson stop Gets under and pops it up. Castro on his way over. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. And there's one down. And digging in for Philadelphia, Alec Bohm. And he swings and misses and it's nothing at one. That one ran inside, almost got him. That's out to center field. Dives and it gets by. Here comes Goldie around third. He'll score and they take a two run lead. The throw to third and he's out trying for three. Now here is Brandon Marsh. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Marsh measures six feet four inches. 25 years old and they went out and made a trade for him last season that misses two balls no strikes good eye right oh. there Three and oh. yeah. and a 3 0 finds his own Three, one. 
And he walked him. One of the things about that two out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So ball down the line or into the gap will produce a two out RBI, and those are the best. That is if you are the offensive side of it. And a foul ball. Here comes the 0 1. Comes up empty. That's strike two. Just misses the mark outside the zone. One, two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Back here in Philadelphia, top of inning number seven. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Brian Reynolds. Jose Alvarado will take over here. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves. Late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. To third. Slings it across. That's the first out at the top of the seventh. Next to bat will be the Pittsburgh cleanup hitter, O'Neill Cruz. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. And a strike in there. Not even close there. It's a ball and two strikes. Fly ball, pretty well struck right field. Harper ranging back. Back some more. Hits the fence. And he's there at third with a triple. Really nice job of two strike hitting in that at bat. Anytime you smoke a ball off the wall, you kind of think about what it could have been. But obviously, you have to be happy with that result. Puts the squeeze on that one. That's out number two. And here's the first baseman, G Man Choi. <laughs> Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Runner from third comes across, and they trail by one. Big RBI for him right there. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. Castro in the box with two gone, and takes a look at a called strike. Right now, they're looking for something hit hard into the gaps. Give them an opportunity with two outs to score that run from first. Struck him out without a swing. Couldn't pull the trigger on a fastball at the knees. On the mound now for the Pirates, Chase DeYoung. Well, what's new? It seems like he pitches almost every game for these guys. This is his 90th appearance of the year. Here's Trey Turner. He's already homered in this game. pitch ball one there the 1 0 this one popped up foul ground first base side one down here's Harper now the right fielder number three Harper Chopper to second. Harper retired. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. Really nice swing in his last at bat. Shot a line drive into center field. Got it started a little too early. Strike one. For a guy that's been swinging the bat well all game long, that was a pretty ugly swing right there. I'm sure he'll tighten it up on this next pitch. This one popped up. Foul ground first base side. Oh, he brought it back. Out of the bullpen for the Phillies, Sir Anthony Dominguez. He's thrown the ball very well overall this season. He's been really tough to get to. You see that ERA, and that's where you love to be. Next offering is in for a strike. Quickly down 0-2 in the count. I think you got to choke up a little bit, spread out the feet. You don't know what the velocity or the location of this next pitch is going to be. Yeah, the 1-2 misses to even the count. 
In the air, right field, pretty well struck. That one's carrying. Pulls it in on the warning track. Well, such a confidence boost for a reliever to come into the ball game and get the first hitter he faces. Just makes everything slow down a little bit, and then from there can really settle in. Next pitch is outside. On the inside corner for a strike. And now it's even up. Just not able to catch up to that velocity. Kicks and deals. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Now batting key Brian Hayes. Swings through that one. 0 oh, 1. Boom. That's Cheddar, baby. Next pitch downstairs. And the count is 1 and 1. The 1 1 is fouled off. At the belt and fires. Foul ball still a one and two count. No, no signs of wavering on the mound here in the eighth. He's looking rock solid so far. Boom. Whips it across, and the inning is over. Out of the bottom of the eighth, JT Real Muto steps in. Young back to work. And there's a wow. ball. That one oh, off the huh? mark. Two balls, no strikes to count. Kicks and fires. Line drive. Balls it in, and there's one away. Here's Paul Goldschmidt, one for three. And the first pitch misses for ball one. And he deals. Just nope. missed. Ball. And another oh. ball. This is a really good feeling for a hitter. At this point in the ball game, you know that they don't want to walk you, so you're going to get a pitch to hit. You just better not miss it. They say you win. And a pitch. In the dirt. And they get Goldschmidt for the out. Now it's the second baseman. Bryson stop. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. Now at the plate, Alec Bohm. First offering, misses the mark. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or run and hit. The 1-0. Swing and a miss. One Threw one. that fastball right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. See if he continues to climb the ladder. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. And here it comes. Blows the high heat past him. That's a strikeout. 
So they bring on the veteran, Craig Kimbrell. And I can't imagine any save is an easy one. You're holding a small lead on the scoreboard, and you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So it's always high stress. Let's see what he's got here to try and close it out. Well, one run game. Now the batter now, Connor Joe. First offering in the dirt. Now one miss. Softly hit to third. Boom. Throws out of first. And they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Good late life on that inside fastball. Ran in on the hands and got that weak contact. Little slow grounder to get the out. Crowd locked in right now. One run game here in the ninth. One, two. Next pitch just misses. Now one and two. Battling here as he fouls it away. The tying run at the plate. Line to second. Snagged on the bounce. And he gets him. Nicely done. Next, it's the Pirates cleanup hitter, O'Neill Cruz. He's already homered here in this one. And fires in a fastball at 95. Next offering is in for a strike. Just amazing to me how many closers and back-end relievers just throw absolute gas these days. I never would have had a chance. Off the mark there. And the count is even, two and two. Left field. And he's got it. Ball game. And the Phillies come in here and finish off a three-game sweep. This was pure domination at home. Huge sweep. And now you go on the road. The flight's going to be very enjoyable. Get into the next city, get a nice meal, get settled in at the hotel, but come back ready to play in the next game. See if you can continue this momentum. I was kind of hoping for some kind of division champ thing, but that's okay. Please buckle up and drive home safely. 